The current is rich in dissolved minerals. And when these nutrients meet the equatorial sun, a miracle occurs. The minerals feed microscopic plants such as diatoms, and in the sunlit surface waters, they reproduce, dividing again and again in an explosion of life. These dense plankton blooms turn the sea into a murky soup that feeds many species, including an unusual predator, the giant flightless cormorant. This small cormorant colony is a busy place. Some pairs have large chicks to feed, others are just beginning to breed. There are no land predators on these isolated islands, so there's nothing here that the cormorants need to fly away from. Over time, they've lost the power of flight. Instead, they walk or swim. There are just a few hundred pairs of cormorants. They live only where the Cromwell current welds up year round on the western Galapagos Islands. All the animals that are prepared to brave these icy waters dine well. <laughs> <laughs> 